Hey my foos, welcome back to my channel. If you're new to the channel, welcome to this channel. So today is Monday and Mondays are for motivation. So I wanted to bring my nighttime routine to you all and let you see what I like to do to prepare for the week, to get my mind together and really to be motivated for the week to get things done. So of course when I'm home, the first thing I usually do is just lounge on the couch, catch up on my social media, you know, Instagram, go ahead and follow me if you haven't. And you know, just kind of watch TV a little bit. I'm sure catching up on Love and Hip Hop or Insecure, one of those, you know. So what are some of you all's favorite shows? Leave those down in the comments for me so maybe I can get into some of those shows. So even though it's difficult, I have to turn the TV off. It is about 9.30 or so. So after I finish watching TV, I like to go in my room and begin planning my week. And also my, if it's the beginning of the month, then I just plan out the entire month. So each day I go through and write out what I plan on accomplishing for that day, for that week. So each month I have a new word and my word for this month is productivity. So after I finish that, then I like to go ahead and begin stretching and this kind of really starts to relax me and prepare me for bed. So now this it's about 9.45, maybe even 10 o'clock. So I do a few stretches, crossing my legs over and um, do a few squats. I like to do about 100 squats each night. So this just really helps me to unwind and I'm still getting a little workout in without doing anything that would be too much and make me wired up for the night. So this kind of really relaxes me, kind of gets my heart rate up, gets a little sweat going. So I do switch it up each time so I don't do the same thing every single time, but I like to keep it minimal. Nothing that will have me hurting or anything like that, but stretching, lunges, squats, things like that. And as I do them, I just kind of take some deep breaths and reflect pretty much on my day and also the week and the weeks to come. Then of course, after I finish that, it's time to wash this face, okay? So I like to use the Dr. Brenner's soap. Oh my gosh, this is perfect to get makeup off, to pretty much get anything off. I use it for so many things. After that, I apply coconut oil to my skin and that keeps me super moist. I have dry skin, so this works wonderfully for me. So I'm already, you know, kind of relaxed, but I love to soak in the tub and I put some oil in there. It's massage oil or bath oil. You can use it different ways. Play a little music and really just unwind and just relax. I try to allow my mind to be free and not so clouded with things. So of course I relax, but I also have to get clean <laughs> and get out. And then now it's time for bed. So I like to light a candle. I love candles. This really makes the room smell so nice. This one is, I believe, watermelon lemonade and it smells amazing. So then I just go ahead and say my prayers. I have a talk with the man above, I have to do that. Before I go to sleep, I like to read something that really stimulates my mind or my spirit. So either devotional or um, a book that I, that's online or I listen to podcasts. And I put my phone on Do Not Disturb and bring the brightness down to like night mode. So then that way I'm not even being bothered and I'm really preparing myself to go to sleep and stay asleep. So I gotta go and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace. Don't forget to subscribe for more and join us fam.